How's everyone doing? Good, I hope. Uh, the the Terry VCS is awesome, you know. Uh, we can play modern games and retro games, you know. So the the, the modern games that we've been playing, uh, we've been playing Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven, Doom sixty four, uh, Destiny two, and um, Resident Evil seven. You know, uh, now we've been playing this game to stay uh, stay you know. Uh, but there's also um another website um called um in Nvidia GeForce now you know uh it works uh the same way as Stadia does um uh, but you uh, don't need a controller with um Nvidia GeForce now um you you use the keyboard and the mouse but I say with some games you could use a controller if you wanted to uh, now with Stadia. Uh, on the Atari VCS, you 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 don't have to use the Stadia controller. You can use an Xbox One controller, PS Four controller. You can use the keyboard and mouse. Uh, like when I'm playing Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven, I use the keyboard and mouse because that just works the best for me. And in my opinion, it's the best way to play that game. Uh, Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven with a keyboard and mouse, you know. Uh, but people are saying like these games aren't really running on the VCS hardware. They're just running off the Stadia servers and the Nvidia servers. And that's true. But it's still awesome regardless. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm still having fun, you know. Uh but like um now I've seen Cyberpunk twenty seven seven actually running on the VCS hardware and it runs like shit, you know what I mean? Uh but it is capable of doing it. Uh, I've seen Borderlands uh, running on the BCS hardware itself and Fortnite, which is pretty good. Uh, but it's, 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 uh, when it gets to something, something like Cyberpunk 2077, the BCS on its own, it, it struggles and you're, you're, you're lucky to get a run on it. But, um, get, like in my opinion, get Stadia, get NVIDIA GeForce now. They're, they're the t two best options to play um, modern games on the VCS, you know. Uh, uh, but, you know, uh, who knows? You know, but, but that's, that's just, I just, just want to make a quick video about that, you know. Uh, the, uh, the VCS really is focused on retro games, which is what I love. Uh, which is the main reason why I want to get the uh, the Atari VCS. But it can play um, modern games. Modern games as well, you know, uh, but the two best options, in my opinion, on the VCS is Stadia or NVIDIA GeForce Now, now with Stadia, you have to buy a membership, which is ten euro a month. Uh, but in my opinion, it's worth it. You know what I mean? The games like um, Doom sixty four, Super Punk twenty seventy seven, Resident Evil seven. I mean, and uh, there's gonna be other games to come. You know. Uh, now we in we uh in video G for us now you have access to Steam and Epic games but only free to play games because um you, you start off with a free membership and if you wanna buy games you have to buy them if you know what I'm saying the same as Stadia if you want if you wanna play the games you have to buy them but in my, my opinion if you wanna play these games on the VCS this is the best way to do it in my opinion. Uh but yeah but the VCS itself, uh, like uh, modern games, Bardlands runs well, Fortnite, um, um, games around that area. I say, I say the original Destiny could run. I say, um, uh, uh, Call of Duty Black Ops, games of that, uh, era or year, you know. But uh, yeah, it does struggle doing. Uh, and the cyberpunk on a town, but uh, but I'm still happy with that. The, I'm happy that it can do it at all, you know. So yeah, and if people are wondering, um, it, what's the best ways to play modern games at the moment without upgrading your VCS or anything like that? Stadia, Nvidia GeForce now. That, that's what we use, you know. Uh, so uh, I hope everyone um has a great day. And remember, if, if you upgrade your Atari VCS, it'll be more capable of running modern games. If you upgrade it to um, uh, the whole specs you can go to, 
yeah, it's got a 